I'm Gary Martin, 103.5 ESPN.com Sports. Some of the best softball players in the country will play tonight in Marion. It's NPF Softball at Rent One Park. The Diamonds versus the Pride beginning a four-game series at 7.05. Riding the Pine with the Fox is going to be live at 5.20. She'll have tickets to give away. She'll visit with some of the NPF folks. And you can get tickets right now here on our website. You can buy tickets at SIMiners.com. We'll broadcast the game at 2.05 tomorrow. Join SIU Softball. Ball coach Kerry Blaylock in yours truly 145 pregame show and first pitch is scheduled for 205. There's another game Saturday night and one more Sunday afternoon. The Cards and the Diamondbacks got off to a late start last night in St. Louis. One hour, six minute rain delay, then another 50 minute delay in the game. Justin Upton hit a two-run home run. Joe Saunders threw five scoreless innings. The Diamondbacks beat the Cardinals four to one. Yeah, we missed opportunities. Yeah. You're right. We- Usually don't get away from away with it, but it did tonight. That's Cards manager Tony Larusa. St. Louis has lost for the fourth time in six games and fell into a first place tie with Milwaukee in the NL Central. Brewers beat the Reds five four. Game two tonight of the series between the Cards and the D backs on the air here on one oh three five ESPN six twenty. Kyle Loshi and Kennedy seven fifteen start time at Bush Stadium. Cubs ten, Nats nine. Chicago rallied from an eight run hole for the win. They avoid a four game sweep. They'll visit the Pittsburgh Pirates tonight a little bit after 6. White Sox fell at home to Minnesota 6-2. to two. Gavin Floyd starts tonight versus the Twins at 7-10 on the south side. Baseball history could be made this evening at Yankee Stadium. The Yankee captain Derek Jeter needs just two hits to reach 3,000. Yankees lost last night 5-1. to one. Jeter with a double to get to 2,998. Tragic news from the uh, ballpark last night in Arlington. 39-year-old Shannon Stone died after falling out of the stands while trying to catch a baseball, tossed his way during the ball game. He fell about 20 feet onto a concrete floor. He fell onto his head and passed away. Frontier League, minors 10, Joliet 4, Southern Illinois avoids the sweep. Here's how they did it. Will Block, two home runs, four ribbies. Sean Coughlin, a grand slam. Five minors had multiple hits. Joe Augustine on the bump, six innings, three runs, three hits. His second straight, Vic, three scoreless innings by the bullpen. Southern Illinois at Windy City tonight. New series, 7.05. Brendan Malkowski is scheduled to start. American Legion Baseball, the 25th District Tournament, begins today in Marion. Murfreesboro Post 127 will not compete. Details with a story here on our website, 1035ESPN.com. The NFL lockout continues. Looks like uh, there's a one issue holding him up. That's an issue with free agency. Tennessee Titans QB Kerry Collins has retired after 16 NFL seasons at age 38. That's a check of 1035ESPN.com Sports. I'm Gary Martin.